This is a rematch. The last time these two match met, excuse me, almost two years ago, it went well. Fast Eddie. Yeah, well, I mean, it, it, this is a pretty tough bull, but I think Eduardo should ride this bull. To, should be to the left, can go both ways, and I think it, I think it'll fit him. What you were talking about, 2016, that's been a long time ago. But Eduardo's going to remember it, 87 and three-quarter points. If he could do that again today, I guarantee there's a Cooper Tires Cowboy that would take that all day long. You have to figure, too, Colby Wright, we often bring this up, bulls and riders. When you go that far back to the last time that they met, Eduardo, a very different rider now. And he, he is, but he could be a different bull as well. I mean, it, it could change for the better. It could change for the worse. I don't think that he worries about that. When it's that far back, he's just there to ride his bull jump for jump. Well, Eduardo Aparecido versus Gangster Can Do. It's the cowboy with the can do attitude, and a Parasito is on the board. This is a bull that has a lot of outside force to him, a lot of outside movement. So he's always trying to work you uh, to the outside. So away from your hand, it's always trying to pull you into your hand. You can see he got a little bit out of whack there, but he just he he tightened up a little bit in order to get back control of that bull. Tenth qualified ride of the round. Yeah, and that's one that Eduardo needed. He had kind of hit a little bit of a cold streak the last couple of weeks, so he needed that to remind him just how good he is and just